Welcome, you have reached review time with Imperial, and today's review is A Quiet Place Day 1. Subscribe to the channel, like the video, let's get into it. Let's go over the cast um, for this movie. So you got uh, Lapita Luangu, she plays as Samara. Joseph Quinn, he plays as Eric. Alex Wolf plays as Ruben. Dijon Hausu plays as Henry. Elaine Umuahara plays as Zena. So the, there's only really uh, Sam and Eric, two main characters um, throughout this. Uh, the reason why Henry's character is important because he's he was in a, a previous. Um, he was in the previous quiet places they really could have did without this movie um you know this is not a must see it's like they capping off of the franchise and just money grab they could have did without this movie the best parts of the movie is just the acting of Lapita. you know other than that the movie storyline it's nothing different. We know about the aliens. Everybody got to be quiet. So, nothing special. You just get to see it from another person's viewpoint on what they've been through. Now, for uh, Lapita's character, her name is Samira. She's a terminally ill cancer patient in hospice. You know, just getting her time out. Her uh, caregiver, uh, nurse Ruben, said that she should go see, you know, a movie like her last bit of time try and enjoy the things that you like to do and of course that this when all this stuff happened and he ended up getting killed so he invited her out Ruben invited her out said she should go to the theater and then everything took place he ended up getting killed meanwhile she had a, a cat named Frodo so that you see the cat throughout the whole movie following her around and Frodo was discovered by Eric and he follows Frodo back because he's, you know, frantic and startled of everything that's going on. Follows uh, the cat back to Sam. Sam has to find some pain medication for her illness, her cancer. And then, of course, they go through this whole thing. You know, the whole thing you used to seeing with the aliens and everything. Get quiet and different events. You see Henry along the way. He runs, Henry runs into someone who is making noise, so he, he had to try to keep him quiet. In the process of doing that, he accidentally killed him. That's enough about Henry. You see Henry again, he makes it to the boat. We all know that aliens cannot swim. So Sam, Samara, she witnesses where um, in New York City, this is where the setting is. They blow up the bridges so that the, um, the aliens can't get out of New York City. And basically, if they try to get out, they got to swim and they're going to die trying to swim. So they also said that they were having boats um, out at the port, you know, for people to get refuge. And so that's the goal. Of course, uh, Samara, she's dying. She's ill. And she, one of the things she wanted to go to the the theater and she wanted to get this pizza, some pizza from this um, specific place that she grew up with her father and everything. And by the time they got to the place, the uh, pizza store was, of course, tore apart. So she, Eric, went out and got pizza from somewhere else and wrote um, the name of the pizza shop on the box or whatever, just trying to give her some good feel. So they kind of made it to like the last scene where the aliens was closing in. She and Eric was boxed in with her um, cat. So the, the game plan was basically take her cat and um, look after her cat. And she's already dying. So she uh, sacrificed herself. So she went out being courageous, made a lot of noise so the aliens would be attracted to her. Meanwhile, Eric got a chance to break free, jumped in the water, made his way to the boat. The boat Henry was on and they pulled him up. Meanwhile, the pizza she was looking at, 
you know, her pictures of her family and childhood. Just, you know, sentimental on that and the uh, aliens closing. The end. Like I said, not much to this movie. It's not a must see. I don't even know if if once it gets to the streaming platforms that you care to go look at it. I mean, you could do without it. You won't miss nothing. Uh, and you just want to see Lapita act cool. Just want to watch it just because, okay. But other than that, you come here so you don't got to waste your time going there. So other than that, out of my four-star rating system, Give me a 1.5 out of 4 stars. 1.5 out of 4 stars. I wanted to give it a 2 because of Lapita. I like her acting. But the movie, it, it wasn't nothing to the movie. So 1.5 out of 4 stars. Subscribe to the channel. Like the video. Till next time.